Hello everyone! Today I'm showing you 7 Dollar Tree Halloween DIYs. This only cost me around $10. I thought it would be so cute to use a witch theme for my Halloween decor this year. Please continue to watch to see how I put this all together. To start with, I printed off these two quotes that I made on photojet.com. I decided to turn these quotes into signs using a Dollar Tree Halloween sign and a Dollar Tree plain canvas. I started by painting the Halloween sign white. I then spread the slightest amount of Mod Podge over the sign. Then I placed the cutout right on top. I also ended up going around the trim of the sign with some black paint to finish it up. For the next sign, I kept it super simple by cutting out the quote and using a Mod Podge just on the outside of the cutout to attach it to the canvas. For the frame, I just used these Dollar Tree popsicle sticks. I painted them black and then I just hot glued them down. I also added a little stand for the back so it would stand up on its own. The next project I used a Dollar Tree coffee cup and this free printable that says Witch's Brew. I'll leave a link in the description box below to the girl that created all of these labels. Her YouTube is Chic on the Cheap. I first just painted the whole mug a matte black. Once it was nice and dry, I used Mod Podge once again to attach the label to the cup. I finished up with adding one of these Dollar Tree Witch Hat Stir Sticks. Next, I made a mini book stack using these three small Dollar Tree planners. I started by painting the planners white. Once they were dry, I took my Amazon stamps and stamped the side of the planners with the little quote, Book of Spells. I finished up wrapping Dollar Tree twine around the book stack to finish it up. For the next project, I took these two amber glass bottles that I found at a ReStore. You could use the normal glass bottles at the Dollar Tree instead, but I wanted to use these ones. I used two more labels that I downloaded from Chic on the Cheap. I added Mod Podge to the back of them to stick right on. The Mod Podge turns the labels into stickers pretty much, which sticks right on the bottles. It's so nice. So next, I took this Dollar Tree Scarecrow decoration and turned it into a witch's broom by first removing the decor on it and then painting the top of the broom a matte black. I finished by adding some Dollar Tree twine to the middle of it. The last project I made, super simple garlands using Dollar Tree twine and Dollar Tree pom-poms. I cut the twine and then I arranged all the pom-poms out the way I wanted them. I finished by hot gluing all the pom-poms down. I made two of them to go on the top and bottom of my tear tray. This tear tray was also a Dollar Tree DIY using two burner covers and two candlesticks. I first laid down this creepy cloth that I bought from the Dollar Tree. I also added in a little greenery just to break up all the black and white.
So that is everything for my Dollar Tree Witch tear tray for Halloween this year. This was so inexpensive yet so cute. I hope you guys try some of these DIYs out for yourselves. If you do, definitely tag me on Instagram so I can see what you came up with. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful and blessed day. Thank <laughs> you.